how did you go in the recent storms? It looks like this tree hasn't survived so well down at our park. I know my mum had a tree fall across her car and break her windscreen. So let's see if we can see why this tree has broken halfway up there. A little bit strange, sometimes the tree tipples over at the roots, but other times it will break halfway up. Now when I see a tree like this, I'm always starting to think, why did this tree fall and not other trees? But as I come up closer and have a look, I can start to see some reason why. It's doing a bit of detective work again. And this is broken off in two pieces. It wasn't just a clean break. It's broken off in two pieces by the look of it there. The other reason is, look at all that foliage there. Big, heavy foliage. So that would have been one reason why it's come a cropper. Now if you just imagine this tree was probably more like uh, this where it had a V at the top where these two branches came in and I would say a crack started a long time ago in that V in there. So if you look at that branch uh, where it, one fitted into the other there, it's all uh, weathered in there. See the darker brown until the light brown here which is the that's the good wood, that's a live wood, but that weathered wood is sort of dead wood. So it's probably been split from there down to about there on that one. And looking at the other one, same sort of thing. This is sort of weathered down there. So I'd say that there's a crack, but down here, that's good wood. That's fairly healthy, good wood. And it snapped off there in the big wind, but because it had a weakness to start with. So most trees that fall over do fall over for a particular reason and this one's no exception at all. Now just to show you one or two other things about a tree, if you were to slice a tree in half and take a cross section, this is the sort of thing that you might get. These are growth rings of the tree and if you count how many growth rings a tree has, you can see how old it is by how many years it takes to get from the center, the heartwood, out to the edge of the bark of where it grows. And you can also see sometimes that some years have better growth than others. Some are smaller, and it may have been a drought in that year or two there where there was not much water to give a good growth for that tree. And so a tree sort of tells a bit of a story, its history, as you look through its growth rings and find out some information from them.